Welcome again, everybody, to Dredge. Um, this is a horror fishing game, from what I know. Uh, I know basically nothing about this game, so I'm very excited to play it. I've heard great things. I'm into horror games, love the mindless fishing games, too, so we'll see. So let's go ahead and get started. New game. The morning light fills your eyes, and you try to sit upright. You're lying on the cold, wet dock where you collapsed the night before. A short man is shouting orders at a handful of workers disembarking from a boat nearby. The man notices you. Welcome to Greater Morrow. I must say, quite the dramatic first impression. I see you've already introduced yourself to the jagged rocks along the bay. Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. Ah, well... I'm glad to see your, our new fisherman upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged, but I've had a few of the locals move your things to one of our old vessels. We'll catch up later to discuss more details. I'll let you get out there to catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while you get your bearings in the light. Finally, I don't suppose I need to say this, but get back by sundown before the fog rolls in. Keep a close eye on the time. It can really creep up on you. Okay, so that's a little ominous. Um, I guess the only option we have here is to undock. So let's do that. Ooh, okay. Move forwards with left stick. Okay, and turn with right. Oh, cool, okay. Ooh, so it's a little sensitive. Let's see if I can get used to that, okay. Move to a fishing spot. Okay, I'm guessing that is the fishing spot. Uh, and start fishing. So this is my inventory here, I'm assuming. Okay, so let's just start fishing. A little timing thing? Nice. That's nice and easy, cool. Um, ah, okay, I see. Let's do that. Um, fish again. Okay, so I am understanding. I might move to a different spot here in a sec just to see what else there is. Stock depleted. What does that mean? Oh, okay. It means I'm done with that area. Cool. Nice. Let's just put that guy up here. I'm horrible with Tetris, so I'm sure I will mess up the inventory system pretty horribly. I think this first day I'm just gonna fish. I'm not gonna do too much exploring. Um, I mean, is that another city? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna head over to that city, I guess. Um, whoops. I don't, oh, fish of the eight now, and there we go. That one was nice and easy. A blue mackerel. That guy right there. Oh, whoops, wrong button. Uh. I don't want to lock that one up. Don't want to lock that one up. Let's do that. Um, I'm gonna go to a different one, see what other fish there are. I don't know if you can tell what fish they are by the water. Time only advances when you're moving, fishing, or taking other specific actions. Okay. Oh, whoops. That was bad. Oh, that's really bad. Oh no. There we go. Okay, this is the same type of fish, so I'm gonna put it in there and move on to the next. I might stop at the city too. Um, so it's 2.30. It's getting a little... Yeah, you don't have the right equipment for this spot, okay. Okay. 
Can I... What's this area? Hmm. Let's see. You look lost, fisherman. After you... Are you after somewhere to sell your catch? Greater Morrow is on the west side of the bay. Keep an eye on the lighthouse, A. Eh? Wouldn't want to lose sight of it for too long. Okay, that's really ominous. Um, you enter a brightly lit shop. It's packed with antiques. The shelves are full of jewelry and other baubles. An old man peers at you over silver spectacles. Hello? Is that? No. Ah, I don't believe we met. Forgive me, my eyes aren't what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets you happen to have. Have you got anything nice with you today, perhaps? Uh, I don't think I do. I think I just have fish. So, uh, what, what is this? It's an engine. Oh, okay, so this is just my ship. I see. I don't have... Uh, <coughs> excuse me. I don't have anything to sell to you, do I? No, I don't. That's fine. Uh, so that's nice to know that that's there. At Little Morrow. I think it's two... It's almost three o'clock. Oh, whoops, I'm going the wrong way. I think we should head back. It's three o'clock. Um, ooh, we might be a little late already. So hopefully we don't get uh, attacked or something. I, I don't know what's out here at night. <coughs> Um, I don't want to go too far past like the buoys and stuff. Oh, sorry, my driving is awful. I'm trying to look around. Um, kind of want to stay a little close. What's this sparkle right here? Uh, inspect a floating buoy. It serves to mark safe passage past dangerous rocks and obscured hazards. The dim light also provides a brief respite in the gloom of the night. Oh, okay, that was super unhelpful. Oh. So, uh, don't do that. Oh, I can... Foghorn. Spyglass. That's nice. Ah! There we go. Okay, so we replied. Very nice. Let's go ahead and get here and dock. Right at sunset. <coughs> you step back onto the dock at Greater Morrow. The mayor is waiting nearby. Ah, I see you've returned in one piece. Very good. Before you head off to town, we should discuss the matter of your boat. As I mentioned earlier, your old boat was too badly damaged to be repaired. However, I'm more than happy to sell you that replacement vessel, yours to own. I understand you may not have the necessary funds on hand, so we'll consider it a loan. But I want to make this easy for you. Until your debt is repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. A small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. So, to recap, you'll need to sell fish to the local market, paying off your debt, and, in turn, keeping the population fed and satisfied. Understand? Uh, let's see... Where do I sell the fish? I think that's a fair question. Our local fishmonger will appraise and purchase what you catch. He's open all hours. Off you go, then. Sell those fish while they're still fresh. Okay, um, go to the fishmonger, a little creepy guy. You enter the, oh wow, that's a word. You enter the squalid shack on the fringe of the marketplace. The familiar smell of fish fills the air. Flies buzz haphazardly around the downcast man behind the counter. You're the new fisherman, eh? Surprised they found a new one so fast. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of curious what happened to the last one. Heh. <laughs> It takes a certain type of person to last out there. It's not a life for everyone. Anyway, to business. I'll pay you for fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some, sp some species are just worth more too. Other towns on other islands might pay you different, but while you've still got debt outstanding here, I suggest you work on paying it off first. So, let's see what you got. Shut up, John. Uh, let's just sell all the fish. Yeah, so these big guys are the more expensive ones. I like it. Okay, what's the X? Oh, because I crashed a little bit. Whoops. Um, 
Let's... I think that's it. The mayor is standing outside the fishmonger store. Excellent work. I have no doubt you'll be able to provide for this town. Look here. I found this by the docks. I'm sure someone like you uh, can make something out of it. Why don't you take it? Uh, what? Oh, a research part? A curious looking component could be used to develop new equipment, but it would need some investigating at a dock first. Okay. Uh, another one? Oh. Oh, okay, I can just uh, place it up there. Last thing, our local shipwright mentioned that she might be able to take some modification to make some modifications to your ship. You should pay her a visit. Oh my god, there's so much going on. Okay, shipwright. As you walk into the yard, you see the shipwright making repairs to a damaged hull. She looks up at you briefly before turning back to her work. You must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Mind you, I'm not in the business of doing favors around here. Payment is up front, and everything takes some time to install. Also, if you take any damage from the rocks, or any damage at all, I can patch it up, mostly. She shrugs and gestures toward the hole she's currently attempting to repair. A number of wooden boards, all well above the waterline, are splintered and scratched. That's horrifying. Take a look around. Just remember, the bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install. So plan ahead. Okay. Um. Uh, what? What do I do? I guess uh, I need to repair that. I'm so confused what this does. Um. Oh well. Is there a better? Fishing rod, bite 150, bite 75. Lightweight rod suited to catching fish that live in the shallows. A small spool. Okay, so I can... So I need that to get the fish I was looking at earlier. Um... Sure. Need another day of that then. Um... Old rusty engine won't get far with this. An old rusty engine won't get far with this. Um... And then some different lights, it looks like. Cool. Um, so, I am just going to return to the town for now, since I don't have anything. Um, oh, the, the loan isn't that bad. Wait, it's 1852. No, I want to dock again. I want to see. Um, let's rest. I feel like, oh, what is that behind the town? That's interesting. <clears throat> you know what, I'm, tonight I think I'm going to stay a little longer out and see what happens. Just to see. But for now, oh, what's the mayor want, got to say? What can I do for you? I'd like to pay off some of my debt. I want to ask about the wider region. What happened to the last fisherman? Um, I'm curious about the last fisherman. Hmm, the last fisherman? Oh, he was very unreliable. He'd go out at night, come back with no fish, and proceed to sleep all day. He was also a terrible captain. I mean, really terrible. Constantly running around the, on the reef, even in the broad daylight. The shipwright almost ran out of wood for repairs. No, he was no good. One evening he left and never came back. So long, you shan't be missed by us. Now, what else can I do for you? Um, I'm gonna talk about the wider region. Certainly. Is there somewhere in particular you, you wish to know more about? Uh, I don't know any of these places. So I guess, just go down the list. Gale Cliffs. Well, the main port over there is the place called Ingfell. It's right on the approach of the cliffs. You can't miss it. It's a whaling town, but I haven't heard much talk of it these days. I think quite a few people have left, one way or another. Is there another area you'd like to discuss? Um, Stellar hmm. Basin. Quite a popular tourist destination. There's a resort on the atoll, built on top of a beautiful coral reef. Coral reef. <laughs> I'm sure there's a wide variety of fish over there. Maybe you fancy getting your hooks into some of those? Is there another area you'd like to discuss? Uh, Twisted hmm. Strand. Hmm, I don't think there's much to tell. It's just a tangled mass of trees. It's often blanketed in a thick fog, even during the day. You want some good lights and a good sense of direction if you're going to ex go explore there. 
Is there another area you'd like to discuss? Finally, let's talk about Devil's uh, Spine. Ah, uh, yes. It's quite exciting, really. An active volcano amongst a city of ancient ruins. I must caution against sailing there, however. The ruins lie low in the water and would surely tear through your hole. Not to mention the aforementioned volcano could erupt at any moment. You can occasionally hear it rumbling from here. Is there another area you'd like to discuss? No, I think that is it. That's all for now.